what took place in northern Humboldt County. Yesterday, shooting ended for an episode from next season that takes place in southern Humboldt County. Humboldt's like traditionally, it's always been a hotbed for squatch activity. It still is. There's still lots of reports, lots of sightings footprints, that sort of thing going on here all the time. James Bobo Fay, a member of the show who has lived in Humboldt County for more than 25 years, says there are at least 40 Sasquatches living in Humboldt County. He worked to bring Finding Bigfoot back to the North Coast for multiple reasons. I wanted to come back to Humboldt because it's beautiful here, and we were off the coast last time inland. I kept telling him, you got to come back to Humboldt and do the Redwoods. It's just visually so stunning. And then plus I'm at home, I can be with my friends. And look for the hard-to-find Sasquatches in the presence of the tallest trees in the world. He says witnesses ranging from members of law enforcement to truck drivers in and around Humboldt County have told him about their experiences seeing Bigfoot. Their whole lifestyle is like that of a downed fighter pot behind enemy lines. Like, paranoid. They're kind of like paranoid ninjas. You know, just like super stealthy and cautious. But they'll be bold at times, too. Squatches don't follow any rules. <laughs> now, Bobo does have some tips for you in case you ever find yourself face to face with a Sasquatch. I think I just heard something. You don't gotta shoot at them. They hate bright lights. Just flick on like a spotlight or a mag light, and that usually gets them to take off. And if you can, try to have a camera handy. Steve King, News Channel 3. All right, thanks, Steve. The episode of Finding Bigfoot that takes place in Southern Humboldt will air this 